Well, good afternoon guys. I have been busy getting up VidCon vlogs all morning, all afternoon. Yeah, day is just about over. But uh, I didn't get a chance to really vlog anything early this morning. I wanted to make sure to get everything up and I checked all the footage that I got. And Needless to say, I think it was a complete success at VidCon. Uh, we had a really good time. Uh, do have some complaints <laughs> about it. It was basically all our friends and old YouTubers, veteran YouTubers, people we've known for years and being able to spend some time with them, it was great. Uh, but then, you know, there's probably maybe 5-10% of it that just annoyed the shit out of me. Uh, you know, you've got maybe 1,000 to 1,500 people that you, uh, that you know or that are YouTubers or content creators that you try and meet or try to spend a little bit of time with those people when you're there. And then there's the events, and then there's 10,000 screaming little girls. Yeah, like that British invasion. All these British YouTubers that it seems so popular. Uh, and if you weren't on your guard, you'd get trampled. <laughs> so being an, an older person on YouTube, and the screaming and the yelling, and being just bombarded by people running through halls and screaming, uh, I'd have to say that we're probably most likely not going to go next year. Um, it was just annoying. Um, and it's gotten so big. And I hear that from a lot of people. Is that it's gotten so big. And unless you're a VIP and you're escorted through back halls or you're, um, you know, being, being basically chaperoned and helped out, that it's not a very comfortable situation. So... I'm kind of like uh, debating it. I don't know. I'm, I might change my mind by next year. But the thing is, is uh, I have to tell you guys this: some news that kind of came up to my <laughs> to my amazement. Tammy kept it secret until uh, basically Sunday. Uh, she is no longer employed, so now we are both unemployed. And what do you do in situations like that? Okay. Well, YouTube is probably not going to be the number one priority looking for jobs is um, so we're gonna be busting our ass to do that but in the meantime while we spend our mornings or afternoons or s some part of the day trying to hunt down jobs and record them and do all that make sure we get our employment and everything then that spare time be spent trying to build our YouTube to the point of where we can make money at it um, so that that's either gonna happen or it's not but we have that ability to do that now so I ask you guys um, to help us out. Uh, I don't care who you are, what kind of social, social media footprint you have, whether it's large or small, please take this Twitter, take this YouTube and all this stuff that's in the description before and please get us out there. We'd like to do this, we've been doing this for five years. We'd like to continue to do this and we wanna roll with it now into hyper mode and just really spend our time doing social media every day and making a living out of it. So let's do this, guys. I honestly, to be honest with you guys, I don't want to get a real job. I don't even know what I would do at this point. I have to like pick one good skill that I, I have that's really good and go with it and see if I can't get a job doing that. But for the meantime, while we're not working, um, old time YouTubers so the vlogs are going to get a lot more intense uh, and projects that we've been working on um, like Tammy's craft channel and all this other stuff to really get on it anyway I'm gonna stop blabbing but uh, I'll probably end up telling you guys a little bit more about VidCon later in the vlog uh, what I thought was a win and what was a lose and what was amazing and uh, just decisions for the future because what are we gonna do you know it's God, it's just you know, the worst, the worst luck. <laughs> I don't know. We'll have to see. But um, anyway, I I hope you guys are enjoying these conversations. I know some people you guys don't like that, but I always like to kind of spill myself out onto onto YouTube and let you guys, um, you know, 
put your comments in and uh, so I can hear your thoughts on what you guys think we should do. So, that being said, I better get back to work. Well, I've been uh, at it for about, oh, I don't know, four hours, five hours editing vlogs. So, it's time to go out and take a break. Uh, I need some coffee. House coffee's good, but, you know, I got a few bucks left over from VidCon that I can spend that I budget. Just basically thanks to you guys. So, cheers. Uh, thank you guys for supporting us to get us to go. Uh, it was, yeah, it was, yeah, it was worth it. Short of a few headaches. <laughs> yeah, it's a beautiful day today. I have to actually say it's, uh, it's nicer than it was in LA. I mean, the weather here is just tremendous. 73 degrees. It's perfect. Just love it. Uh, simple things make me happy. Yep. Simple things are the best. Believe it. <laughs> it's good to be home. I miss this. I've always been a water baby. Love living next to the water. The closer I am, the better. The happier I am. With a mouthful of scone. <laughs> All right, I'm just about there, getting done with the, getting caught up with the vlogs. Got the other one uploaded. Um, boy, the buzz for vlogumentary is really getting big. Um, you know, hashtag. I'm vlogging here. That's what it was called before. I don't know if that's going to throw any confusion to it getting out there, but I wish them the best. Uh, again, I, with just how emotional that thing was for someone who's been in that community or around that community for five years, well, five years vlogging and almost seven years on YouTube, uh, it's, it's quite emotional. Um, I mean, every time I watch that thing or tweet it out or whatever to promote it, I get very emotional. Um, again, that thing is amazing. They've, they're doing a really good job. But I also, I'm also kind of emotional in other ways other than just looking forward to it and knowing all these people and seeing what they went through in their lives. The other reason I'm a little bit, I don't know, I wouldn't say upset, but we were pretty close to being considered to be part of it, maybe as a, an outside observer would have been probably the best part for us, is that we're not successful, well, or successful to a point of knowing people, or interacting with our viewers on a level that's pretty serious. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that, that kind of that kind of makes me sad too is that, that that I don't think anything else like this will, will will ever be done again you know I know that there's other people that have done things similar to it that probably are not nearly going to be as successful as this and I, I know I'm almost positive this thing is going to be huge and to leave your legacy that would have been it and after seeing it it just kind of a little a tiny little bitterness in 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 not being able to be taken part of it and I know what you guys are probably going to say you know something else will come along but you know I don't know it's just one of those things where I think I've got the VidCon blues <laughs> you come home and you're like kind of bummed out it, there's things you didn't do there's footage I wish I could have gotten that were like you know you almost have to have a camera running on you 24-7 and I think uh, that's going to be something that we need to work on. Like I talked about earlier at length is, you know, we need to figure out our future. Me and Tammy really need to sit down and figure out what we're gonna, what our plan is going to be other than just really superly concentrating on a job like eight hours a day. You know, try to get that out of the way and then concentrate on living our, in li our lives and blogs and maybe doing interviews as, you know, as soon as we can do them and get reemployed. But uh, as of right now, I mean... Why Why is it we try so hard and we go to VidCon and we do all these things to try to help this and 
it just doesn't push us forward because now it seems like it's it, it's very important that financially we do something with this that we've built up over over the years for so long and I'm probably gonna have to do some things that I'm gonna regret regret either bombing social media hitting up people for help trying to get up my projects done and out and and get these short movies made and and try to get some buzz again because the whole thing about VidCon we did this year kind of failed. Uh, you know, finding out about Tammy's, you know, being unemployed and my son leaving earlier, that's a whole nother story. And basically just getting upset, getting drunk. And if I said anything that was off color to any of you guys at VidCon and my drunk banter or whatever, I'm sorry. But, um... Uh, I'm trying to stay above water and not letting myself drown in this depressed hole of existence of just doing these daily vlogs and fucking kicking some motherfucking ass. And I'm sorry, I'm going to use bad language, but I'm tired of it. It's time to do something about it. I know we, we have your guys' support. We have our, our core group that's here every day leaving a comment. But I'm not gonna let it. I'm not gonna leave it at that anymore. I'm tired of it. I am t sick and tired of it. I want to make something of this. I want to see a freaking check come in because I don't. You know, editing for so so long is great and I enjoy it and it is kind of therapeutic to me. But sometimes it's just like you know, I want a fucking check. I want to make some money. I want to make a living. In this I want to be able to be entertaining people and getting paid for it because right now that's all we got. So again, I'm gonna say it. And we need your guys' support as much as you guys can give, you know. And if you are a YouTuber or someone who's up and coming, we'll take you with us. You know, you help us out, we'll help you out. So let's build this little network of, you know, you know, this little core group and start getting on some of these projects. If you guys have anything you guys want to do with us, contact me. And, uh, and I'll do it. Um, it. If there isn't anything else for us to do. So that being said, I'm just kind of just clearing my head of this and hopefully you know things will change i know you guys are saying you know better things to come but that isn't always the freaking case you know it's and i've been saying that and i've been trying to stay positive about it but we just seem to be getting and you know ungreased un un just every time and it, it really hurts plus uh for those of you guys that are popping onto my videos every day that are thumbing them down and I know who we, I know who you are. I know what troll you are. I don't know who you are. Please just leave us alone. We're tired of being abused. You know, if you're if you're feeling up to it, leave a comment and let me know where you live. <laughs> because I'd like I just dare you. I dare you. I freaking dare you to leave a comment. But we know you don't have any balls, so I'm sure that won't happen. I was going to say that because I just realized that uh, I immediately got like a couple thumbs down on uh, on Saturday's, or sorry, Friday's video. And needless to say, that kind of made me a little bit angry too and bitter as well. That kind of brought this conversation on is that, you know, you guys are probably like saying, oh, don't worry about it. It's, you know, screw the trolls. But that person just sits there and waits, waits until he sees a tweet. Heads over there, pops onto multiple accounts, and goes. I hate that. I really do. That's a big freaking dog. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna stop talking. I don't have much else to offer you guys today because it's just an editing day. So, I hope you guys enjoy my banter. I don't know. I'm gonna try to finish out the night and uh, hopefully get the rest of these up. I think uh, I'm gonna save one for tomorrow, as well as uh, today's the one you're watching now and uh, yeah I guess I got stuff to mark off the list meeting with idea with Shay or George that never happens brand deals there isn't such a thing uh, we don't have any no one wants t-shirts yeah certain things didn't happen at VidCon oh well anyway back to work